Bro, you make me go so loco, loco, make me go crazy. We would make a beautiful baby. Knock on wood, is you trying to take? Hey everyone, it's Mai here, and I'm back with another video. And as you can tell from the title, this is going to be my official college move-in video. Before we get into this video, don't forget to subscribe, like, and hit that bell to join the community and stay updated with all of my future uploads. It is currently 11.54 p.m. and we are about to leave out to travel to Granville, Ohio, where I'll be moving in to Denison University. I'm really excited to record this video because as I was looking for Denison content on YouTube or just like anything about Denison in general, there was very little uh, to find. So I was like, you know what? I'm gonna be that one person to just give y'all the scoop, give y'all the tea, give y'all everything you need, you feel me? So a little bit of context before I move into this video. Um, I'm attending Denison University in Granville, Ohio. Um, I am going to be, the residence hall that I'll be staying in is called Crawford Hall. I'm staying in a standard double room. Um, and I'm actually moving in on August 20th, which was literally in five minutes. <laughs> I'm moving in on August 20th, and I think I'll be arriving from the time from anywhere from like eight to nine, I'll be arriving to my dorm um, to move my stuff in. Um, I'm arriving August 20th because, yeah, I'm attending a pre-orientation called Paving the Way, so I'm arriving five days earlier than the typical move-in day, which is August 25th. So um, that's a little bit of context. If I end up remembering more things as the video goes on, I'll be sure to inform you guys so that you guys know. But I remember when I was watching videos, I literally just couldn't find anything on Crawford Hall. I, um, I didn't really know what kind of rooms people were staying in. So I just want to let you guys know which hall I'm staying in, Crawford Hall, and the room, which is going to be a standard double. Um, and I heard that Crawford Hall is actually renovated and that it's also really spacious. So I will let you guys know once I arrive what that is actually looking like. So I'll see you guys throughout this video. I hope that you all enjoy. And without further ado, let's get straight into this video. If I wrote you a symphony Just to say how much you mean to me What would you do? If I told you you were beautiful Would you date me on the regular? Tell me would you? Well baby I've been around the world But I ain't seen myself another girl Like you This ring here represents my heart there's just one thing I need from you Say I do Because I can see us holding hands Walking on the beach, our toes in the sand I can see us on the countryside Sitting on the grassland side by side You could be my baby Let me make you my lady Girl, you amaze me Ain't gotta do nothing crazy See, all I want you to do is be my love So don't give away My love So don't give away My love Another woman that can take your spot, my love. So don't give away my love. So don't give away my love. So don't give away. There's another woman that can take your spot, my love. Moving day, Denison University, 2026. No, 2026. That's when she graduates. All right, y'all. The official dorm tour. Woohoo! All right. You didn't even do the movie. You didn't even video. Got it. Woo! Bam. Our names are on the door. And then these are the pre orientations that we're in. And then you come in. All right. To the right. This is my closet. We got a little cart in here. And then here are all my sweaters, jackets. I have a shoe rack down here. Uh, I have my laundry stuff over here in a hamper and then up here is a lot of other storage space Oh up there is also storage space. So it's like a really really huge closet area It's way more storage than we expected, but that's how the closet looks Over here my name is spelled out and then they have a bunch of different shelves here I'm probably gonna put like perfumes and makeup stuff here. There's also a medicine cabinet here And my roommate has one as well and then we have all of our drawers and stuff, like filled with clothes. If you come this way, on this side is my roommate's stuff, but I'm gonna show you guys my side. 
On my side, I have, have my pictures hung up, so just so you guys can see. Uh, I would get a better close up, but like I can't get on my bed right now because I have my shoes on. <laughs> but yeah, I have my pictures, and then on my bed, I have this fluffy pillow. I have some regular pillows. Um, we ended up putting this like bed mat on it. I forget what it's called. It's like an extra comforter, whatever. But yeah, I have my pillows, um, and I decided I decided to do a really like colorful uh, pink, blue, purple type theme. There's one more pillow on the way. My parents just went to go get it. But I have a bunch of animals and stuff right here. My plushies, and then my bed is mounted. So there's a lot of literally mad space, like mad space i have my two bags under here this will eventually move but the black bag is going to be what i'm taking for my pre-orientation and then this is just all my electronics and stuff i have a rolling cart which i'm going to e eventually empty out and put different stuff in but this is full of like my makeup perfumes deodorants other bathroom essentials and hair products they do give us a drawer where we can put like other items and stuff and you can lock it all right so over here i have like my little desk area um, over here I just have some like books and my yearbook and other stuff from like Beacon, which is my high school. I have like my little pen um, and pencil holder. Got my whiteout, stapler, you know, all the little essentials and stuff. Got this little fake plant to go up there. This is a little light um, for at like nighttime and stuff. If like I'm staying up late and I need to work on something. And it also like charges your phone. It's like a sensed one so you can like switch it up. I have a mirror here if I want to work on like my makeup or anything in the mornings. Here I have uh, my book, Bible, and cards. And then under I have like my little um, trash can and a bunch of other like books and stuff like right under here. Um, as for under my bed, well I have a little um, rug here. But under my bed I have two backpacks which won't be there. Um, I'll move those eventually. Um, I have my mini fridge, um, I have my cart which I'm about to work on now and take out like my perfumes and stuff. And then over here is just like a little drawer and stuff. And then I also have like my fan all mounted on my bed which is actually blowing right now for nighttime. Um, and so yeah, that's my little section y'all. Um, the dorm itself is very spacious. I don't want to get too close to my roommate's side, but like the dorm is OD spacious, y'all. Like all of this walk space is here. Like I could literally like, <laughs> y'all, that much. Oh, and this is how this area looks. It's like split half and half. I do advise y'all to bring some type of fan and stuff. Some people brought ACs and TVs and whatnot, but it's really up to you and like what you want to bring. Like, yeah. But yeah, I really, I like my roommate. It's so sweet. Um. Everybody here is just so sweet. I love the vibes on campus. I'm really excited to start classes and join and stuff. And you know, just get in the groove of things. Um, this is such a huge transition for me, but I know it'll be good. It's really giving me like study abroad vibes back from when I went to Morocco. So if y'all didn't watch that vlog, go watch that for real. But yeah, I met a good amount of people today and it was just really cool. Um, I feel like I'm definitely becoming more extroverted in this environment, which is really cool. I'm like pushing myself to meet new people and step out of my comfort zone, which is really what I wanted for myself. So I'm just really happy to be here. Um, and yeah, that's just a little bit for y'all. But yeah, y'all. <laughs> this is so cute, I'm so excited. But yeah, I'm about to set my stuff up right here. And I'll show you that once I'm done. All right, y'all. So I finished this area. I ended up putting the batteries inside of the letters, um, so that's how that looks. Um, I also put all of my perfumes, deodorants, and lotions on this shelf, and then I put my makeup box and nail box on top of here as well. And then up here, I just have a random freshener and a water bottle. <laughs> but that's how my area looks. I don't know what this is. Oh, it's not mine. But that's how the area looks, guys. Ah! All right, y'all, this is the single bathroom. It's a shower, and then the toilet. Hey! <laughs> All right, y'all, we are outside. Ah! My dorm is completely finished. Way. They just brought a refrigerator to my room from a senior. Did you see really it when nice. you came in? Apparently my dorm is really far from the classes and another dining hall. But we're gonna see what's going on. I'm also near a bunch of other 
upperclassmen dorms. We're walking to Hoffman Dining Hall. Um, apparently, uh, Slater, I think it's called. I don't know the name of these buildings, but apparently the other dining hall has better food. But for the parents, Hoffman comes through apparently. So we're gonna see. Like the, you know, the people are seem really chill and down to earth, and the campus is really like nice and quiet, quiet. and empty. Yeah. So you don't want to make too much noise, right? The mm. car ride was eight hours from Maya. Maya. New York Maya. to Granville, Ohio, Maya. and that was a hassle. Maya, I'm gonna miss you. Actually, made it to the official dining hall this time. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, that's that thing. It's not me recording in the dining hall. I must be stopped. Huh? I'm giving them. All right, y'all. We just arrived to the dining hall. Um, my family decided to take a walk. <laughs> We're not even on campus anymore. <laughs> we have to be to the chapel in ten minutes. No, four. In four minutes. Damn. And we got a ten minute walk back to campus, up the hill, and to the chapel. But don't worry y'all, it's gonna be all right. Yo, this is unacceptable. <laughs> y'all can feel my lunch coming up. All right, pizza, that pizza, I just ate. Dennis and Bob really not about to see me next year. We're gonna be in the chapel breathing in everybody's ears. Like, <laughs> it's gonna be mad silent. It's gonna be us in the back. <laughs> the ultimate winners. <laughs> Um, and I did end up changing. Um, I put some glasses on, did my eyebrows, lashes, I did highlight and a gloss. So that's how everything's looking. I'll see y'all soon. Let me take it back over here real quick because I just used this mirror and I absolutely love it. Like this mirror eight. So I'm finna head out in a bit. Um, to do like a little movie night with my group so this is the hairstyle i'm gonna probably log on to my laptop and stuff real quick and make sure that i know my login information for tomorrow but they have us bringing our laptop and a bunch of other stuff for uh the move-in so i'm gonna probably just check through my bags and stuff now make sure that everything's packed thank you guys so much for tuning into this video i hope this video was really helpful and giving you guys an idea of what the crawford hall at denison university looks like and a bit of what my move-in day was like um it was definitely a hassle at certain times like you know making sure that everything was ready and done and whatnot but today was really good i met a lot of amazing people i had a lot of fun with my family um for the last time before they left and i'm really excited to see them again i know they just left but like i can't wait to see them again during break so yeah today has been a great day and i'm really excited to bring you guys more college content so if you guys want to see more college content and more things from Denison university such as a day in my life type video comment down below which i want to see comment down if you like this video comment down below if you have any questions and thank you guys so 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 much for watching don't forget to subscribe like and hit that bell to stay updated with all of my videos and future content and I'll see you guys in the next one. Much love. Till next time.